You can watch us live right now, and you can see our wonderful guest, Mr. Clinton Baptiste. Yeah, he is. Oh, lovely. Good morning. Namaste, Chris, friends, everyone at home. You all right? Yes. Yeah. Spirits very, very strong oh. in this. And can I just add? Yeah. I've come in here quite close. Quite, uh, has someone passed? Is that you, Dominic? Because there's not a lot of air in here already. Please right. don't no, do I, that. <laughs> Disgusting. I, I that, haven't I haven't. It could passed. be eggs. It could be, couldn't it? No, I don't like that. You there know, picking eggs. up a spiritual plane and bovril from... Anyway, the thing is... <sighs> I'm wearing a new outfit you for look, you. You look right. amazing. Oh, that's incredible that outfit. In, yeah, wow. Uh, it, I do find the sequins do attract spirits. Really? And if you look on the back... Yep. Turn around. Turn around for me. What is that? I can see. I am going to prove to you this is sacred. I'm going to bend over backwards to show you my third eye. Yes. In this studio. Oh, mm-hmm. but, uh, if anyone's got the cameras on. Can we just say this... That I don't want anybody to think I take this very lightly. No. Very, very serious. I was at a funeral the other day, and there was uh-huh. a the gentleman burying his wife, a wed- w- 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 widower, mm. and uh, he said, he leaned over to the, the vicar, and he said, have you got the Wi-Fi code? Uh-huh. And the vicar said, outrageous at your wife's funeral. And he said, and is that all lowercase? Mm. Right. Yeah. I'm not like that. No. Take it very, very serious. Well, you do. And Dominic earlier, mm. Dominic, mm. Does an impression of you? Oh, it's it's yeah, it's right. really. It's and I was saying, you know, and it's but it's with love. It is with love. Right. It's only with love. Blasphemy, but go on. Yeah. But as you know, I'm I'm a bit of a skeptic when it comes to all of this. But mm. I'm fascinated. I'm an avid listener to your podcast. Right, thank you. The Paranormal Podcast, Clinton Baptiste, the yeah. Paranormal Podcast Series Three, so streaming now on all podcast platforms. Thank you so much. Streaming now, and you have a gift. I do have a gift. You do. I do, and um, I want you to know that if you do listen to the podcast, mm-hmm. uh, it will give you an insight into my gift. Yeah. And I'm going to release a book th- this Christmas, Clinton Baptiste Probes Our Souls. Which oh, will be lovely. Out oh, in, great. In the shops this it's lovely. That is Christmas. Yeah. Well, that'd be the perfect gift. Absolutely. What does 29 mean to you? 28? 27? Tw- 25? 22. Tw- 22? Yeah. What does that mean to That's you? That's my Chris? birthday. T- that's right, two little ducks, isn't it? Yes. I suddenly saw two li- And I've got someone here. Yeah. Really? <laughs> Dominic, it's a... Yeah. Oh. It's... Mm. It's a man or a woman. Is that ringing any bells? A man or, or a woman. Or a woman. And oh. I've got this man here, yeah, yeah. and he's, he's showing me parchment. 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 Old paper, and he's written something on it about what you did this weekend for your health. Re- walking, oh. he says, walking all weekend. Walk- walking. Actually, I'm reading that again. Forget that. That's mm. that's not good. That. All right. What I wanted to say to you is this, Chris. I've got someone here. <laughs> it's quite a sophisticated man, quite cultured. I, 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 I'm guessing he's not your family, and he's saying. <laughs> He's saying it's just a yeast rash. That'll clear up with a bit of E45. Oh, my God. So oh, don't worry about that. that. Is, that's that's yeah. going to go. That's okay. a relief. And he wanted I, I you that to means. have that. And anyone watching home, that's a feather. Right. From his yeah. Celestial wings. Anyone oh, that's have that. Wow, that's... Disinfect that. That that's was it. coming Lovely. handy. Wipe it down. Wow, Wipe yeah. that down. That is... Mm. Thank you very much. Yeah, and he's fading now. Anyway. He's going. He's, fa- he's gone. He's gone now. It's, it's an amazing... Gift that you have. Mm. Yeah, yeah. How did it? How did it all begin? I yeah. don't know the beginnings of of how you realised. Many years ago, Ooh. Ooh. Gy- sorry, many years ago, a gypsy. Yeah, kept, not allowed to call him that now. But anyway, came yeah, up to me, yeah. Adam, and she said, "I've got someone very, very important wants to speak to you." I said, "Who is he?" Who is? She said, "Jesus Christ Almighty." I said, "All right, I only asked," <laughs> but she said. She told me things that nobody else could have known. Right, really. That growing up, I had a little dog called Sammy. Oh. That I once made an ashtray in metalwork for me mum, and that I have got a birthmark in the exact shape of Greg Wallace off of MasterChef. Wow. Really? Just on my Goochel area. But right. that, and she, oh. nobody else could, oh, that was uncanny. No, no one else could have known that. No, no one. Specific. And I said, Greg well, Wallace. Septic. Very specific. Oh, sorry. Very specific areas. And. She said to me, it wasn't, was, no, it wasn't, but no. what she said, I tell you what, Master Chef, this is true. Mm. 
we got a drinking game in my house. Oh, the really? Bachelor. The second Greg Wallace comes on the telly, we turn it off and go down the pub. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Great game. That's a good um, game. That's a good game. That's but now I just game. want to say very quickly, nearly finished. Uh, my mother, I mean, I remember growing up, I, I said to her, uh, she said, what on earth are you going to do, uh, you know, if, when you grow up, when you leave school? I said, mother, I told you, I'm not like the others. I've got something extra. She said, we've been to doctors about that. Just don't mm. scratch it, she said. Yeah. And she said, I said, yeah, and I said, that, you know, I'm going to be the lord of my own universe. She said, come on, don't be an idiot, Keith. Come and work with me at Iceland. Right. Yeah. Which I did. So it was always poo-pooed. A lot of poo-pooers yeah, out there. A lot of poo-pooers. A lot of poo-pooers out don't there. But you, but you went forward. I went forward, yeah. And you obviously learnt about the celestial realm and, and all of oh, that. Oh, very much so. And I've used my gifts all over the world. Yeah. Mm. I've met loving ghosts in Italy, unnerving ghosts in Morocco, and I've nearly crapped myself in Bucharest. Right. Uh, just come back from Thailand. I love the spirituality and the culture. It did put mm. me on ping pong a bit, but apart from that, <laughs> before that I was in the Isle of Man trying to contact the living. Yeah. But the thing is... <laughs> I have a gift, and I want the listeners to, yes. to understand that. Yeah. I think they appreciate it. Yeah. They do. Um, you can hear more in the podcast, Series 3. Yeah. It's been very well. Clinton Baptiste, the Paranormal Podcast. Wherever you get podcasts from, it is there. Yeah. Yes, thank you. And you can learn a lot. Now, what can we expect for Series 3? Because we've learned a lot so far in 1 and 2. Mm. Right. Uh, you have a spiritual guide. Tarawak, who's yeah. uh, an Eskimo, not allowed to say that, Inuit. No, Inuit. An Inuit. And uh, in this series, it all takes place at a healing festival. Yes. Oh. I've gone up in the world, I'm mixing with middle class types like right. Pippa here. Mm. That's oh, right. Thank uh, you. You know, and who are into all new age stuff. Intelligent people like me, broad minded people. Yes. Not the end of the peer types that I've uh, come to, you know, come to know over the years. And they're all, mm. you know, apart using words like um, granola and that. And cuscus. Yes. I'm very au fait with that now. Quinoa. Quinoa. Oh, yeah. Quinoa. That's the quinoa. quinoa, isn't it? Yeah, is quinoa. It quinoa. That's what I thought it was, yeah. Chris. But you're common as muck like right. me, aren't you? <laughs> right. Yeah. Well, so that's, yeah. well, sort of. But anyway, I just want you to enjoy it. And it's all set, t- takes place at a healing festival. Oh. And uh, last year. It's lovely. Yeah. That's nice, lovely. Isn't it? Yeah. How have you been with all the COVID and the, and the lockdown? Terrible. Oh really? my God, it's terrible. It is. I'm, I feel sorry for, for uh, Gareth Southgate, don't you? Well, I, I mean, what with all the birds coming in the hotel rooms and the, the, the parties, the yeah. COVID parties, he's only got about eight people to pick from. I know. <laughs> I've got the new uh, FA um, track and trace. If you've been anywhere near an England footballer, Christ's sake, stay in. Yeah, yeah. That's, what that's they're basically saying. it, isn't that's, that's it? That's it. good it advice. Is it, yeah. But you staying positive. Too. I'm staying positive, yeah. yeah, yeah. And I've got to tell you, I'm. I've got Ian McCaskill here. Ian McCaskill? Hey. Ian McCaskill. I and he's saying... Him. What are you saying, Ian? Yeah. <laughs> he's saying blue skies ahead. Oh, oh that's He's lovely. saying blue skies ahead. Thank you, Ian. So don't worry. Everything's going to be absolutely lovely. Not to worry. Oh, And lovely. it's... I mean, they're all... I mean, everything's taken care of. I've got a clean muff in front of me here on the microphone. Yeah. yeah. And we're all sitting socially distant. We are. Oh, we have to So now, don't I we? just want you to know that everything... Don't worry out there, everybody. Everything's going to be A-OK. Not oh, lovely. That's, that's the positivity we need. That's Absolutely it. right. That's yeah. right. Can I ask a question? Oh. If it's because I am fascinated. Yeah. When you when the, when the spirits come to you, when the yeah. the people come to you and they talk to you, is it? Do you hear? Is it in their voice? So like Ian McCaskill, then yeah. he mm. said, "Blue skies." That's right. But do no, you, you can hear, choose any voice you want. Blue right. skies, he said like that. Blue really? skies, right? You know? But what I I can't hear them. Because he'd be more I, like blue skies. Bleach guys, he right. said. And Please I said, guys. all right, no one likes to show off. You right. weren't yeah. known for your voices, in weather. Right. But what I do insist, and I can't hear them that well, because I said, can you stand back two metres? I like to whisper in me, and I go, I- actually, yeah. can you keep back? The, yeah. the spirits have to... Two yeah, very much. They so. have oh, to stay. They? oh, they're, they're oh, roped off. That. They're very much roped off. Wow, it's that's that's after hard. I spoke to them, it's the old happy birthday to washing your hands, yeah. Your hands yeah. and all that. Yeah, yeah, but they're all here, and um, oh. Elvis Presley here. Well. <laughs> Really? Elvis, yeah. And in, in the room? Yeah, he's here and he... Oh, he, 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 says he put on, He put on a bit of weight, yeah. yeah. He said he's had pies, pasties, sausage rolls. He said, in fact, in the words of the rapper Coolio, he's been living in a Ginsters paradise. Right. So. Oh, oh, I love him. Yeah. Well, it's lockdown, isn't it? It's, it's lockdown, it has done it. But, everyone's um, in the same boat. Everyone's in the same boat. But what I want to say to anyone who can't see Elvis gone already. 
Hey. Is Elvis gone? Oh, he's disappeared. He's oh, that was quick, he's wasn't it? Well, the canteen's opened. Is it like, <laughs> popped in for one gag and he legged it. That's what yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. That was it. But um, I just want to say that... Can I just say this? That for anyone who's not watching at home... Yeah. I am wearing... How do you, just for the young people out there, just yeah. topical. I look like Alvin Stardust, don't I? Yes. I do, for the yeah, young people. It's there a was very clear Is that a jumpsuit? Yeah, it's yeah. a jumpsuit, yeah. Lovely. Yeah, but um, I find it's, you know... And, oh, I've got someone here. What? Dom. Oh, oh, oh. This is lovely. It's an elderly lady. Oh. <laughs> and she wants you to know this. <laughs> this is lovely. She's saying if she hadn't oh. died, yeah. she'd still be alive now. Wow, she wants she that to be a comfort to you. Oh. And she says, you did something for her that not a lot of people would do. Really? And I, I know what it is. I wouldn't do that in a million years, right. mate. It could be anything. Oh. Do you know who that is, Tom? Yeah. Well, I mean, it could be... An old lady. An old lady. Yeah. You did something for her. It narrows yeah. it down. Yeah. If she wasn't dead now, she'd still be alive. <laughs> Yeah, but nearly not. killed her. I'd have to say whatever yeah. it was. Really, that's tasteless. Doesn't matter. Let's move on from okay, that. Sorry, yeah, that's tasteless. Never stopped us before. No, no. no now no, we we right. have we have some questions. Right. Okay. If that's okay, because obviously I believe in everything. Yeah. yeah. But there are people out there who who they, they still need you know a bit of convincing. Yeah. But right, they have okay. questions. The naysayers. The naysayers. The yeah. poo pooers. That's right. The poo pooers. Right. So if on. I just pick some a random question from right, the text. Go on, then. Go on. Okay. So. uh Johnny has texted in. Mm. He's messaged in from Trafford Park. Oh, yeah. He's Johnny the Red. Right. He wants to ask, will his team win the league? Mm. So that we're... Oh, just, <laughs> I, mean, oh, okay. I think you don't have to be psychic to know that, do you? Right. You don't have to be clairvoyant. What I will say is yeah. I invented, yeah, I predicted the tsunami, mm. uh, the invention of the Swegway and the Muller Fruit Corner. Mm. In 2012, I predicted the iPhone 4 would be a runaway success. And in 2014, when Cheryl Cole brought out her last album, Only Human, I successfully predicted, right, that the first single... Yeah. She would release from that album would indeed be crap. Right. 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 And I was, it's uncanny, that um, skill. But even I could not have predicted Man United 1, Spurs 6. Right. But what I will say is, can I just say this? I'm getting... Go on. Yeah, I'm getting this. 23-24. 23-24. Put a bet on for 23-20. Oh, no, sorry. No, you'll come 23rd or 24th in the sky bet. So right. It's in, <laughs> that's it next season. Right. So, right. yeah. That's what I'm getting. Oh. Sorry, oh. Johnny. Be. Johnny the Red. He's Johnny the Red. That, Sorry about he? that. No, that's a shame. Oh. Um, do you want another question? Yes, please. Okay. Um, this is from Dave in Northampton. Right. He wants to know, in the current climate, yes. can he actually go out at all? Well, <laughs> ah. Dave. Dave lives in Northampton, doesn't Northampton, he? Northampton, yeah. Mm. What on earth is there to go out for? Stay that's, in, mate. I've been there. That, yeah. Hunker oh. down. That's it. Sit it out <laughs> and then move. A, that's a good point. <laughs> Sit it out and then move. Yeah. That's Sit it out and then move. And that's, you know, that's not me. That's not a psychic speaking. That's just geographical sure. yeah. sense. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's for Dave. Um, Dave's there. Yeah. Lucy Graham is in Sheffield. Right. Okay, love. She says she's looking for a new challenge. Yeah. And she's asking, should she enter MasterChef? Well, you know my feelings on Greg Wallace, and yeah, well, I said that about five minutes ago. I so know. let's draw a discreet <laughs> veil over that. We've done that. We've done that. I can't. I couldn't see in the future that you were going to ask me probably the same well, question. Well, because you just know you don't. The questions just come up. Yeah. on the on this one yeah. random. On the I screen. would wanted to enter MasterChef. Mm -hmm. uh, mm. I don't know whether you remember that. Yeah, I won't say which. No, which I know. I, I, I guess. Yeah. There's something in there. Stay, do you want another one? Yeah. Yeah, go on. This yes, is actually. Please. this Now, this, my girlfriend. Right. Believes in, in manifesting. Yes. Uh, you know, putting things out there. Yeah, to okay. the universe. And right. Steve in Hereford is, is texting and saying, Does manifesting actually work? Where you are offer up to the heavens and yes. you, like, you put it out uh, there. Uh, to absolutely. The I. Want to make this absolutely clear? Yes, it does work. Wow. Yes, oh. it does work. It does. But oh. be precise. Be specific. Right. Um, I distinctly said to my PR people I wanted to go on a, a top-rated independent radio station sure. to promote the podcast. <clears throat> and the other thing right. is... <laughs> can I just specific. say, yeah. I'm getting... <laughs> in this studio here, I'm, I'm, seeing, I'm seeing tiny figures... 
Tiny, oh. tiny, tiny figures. Does Ray Jow mean anything? I don't, I don't to, really know. I don't <laughs> not can really I just, know. Not. But no, what I want to say is about manifesting. Be precise. I knew a lady who said she wanted to be swept off her feet by a pop star. Next day, George Michael knocked her over, picking up his dry cleaning. Oh. oh. Wham. Yeah. That's, oh. that's going to happen. That's going to happen. Yeah. So, you know, just be precise. Yeah, precise. You know, what? I mean, you might say, I want a knight, a knight in shining armour to come yeah. and collect you. Yeah. If Major Tom Moore turned sure. up, it's not the same. It's not the same. No dis- disrespect to him. No. Great Incredible. going up and down the, yeah. the tarmac. Yeah. But be specific. Be specific yeah, for that's... crying out loud. Before you write in about Major Sir Tom Moore. Yeah, yeah he's lovely. No, he's he's did, did and lovely. All, he did a, all joking aside, he did a good he did, job. He did a good he? job. Um, do you want another question? Yeah. Okay. Helen in Macclesfield. Yes. Now, again, mm. I don't know if this is a frivolous question. Right, go this on. probably has a serious answer. Yeah. Asks, do you know what is the meaning of life? Oh, blind. Oh, wow, that's, that's a bit too... Oh, I mean, that's that is cute. the ultimate question. I don't it? expect you to know that. Look, there are many, many mysteries, Chris. Yeah. Um, you know, how did the oceans form? Mm-hmm. Who built the pyramids? How did Amanda Holden get to judge a talent contest? Yeah. <laughs> all mysteries. All mysteries but what i will say is and can i just say she's in macclesfield i see a very unique place i see glass i see macclesfield very much the glastonbury of the northwest you do extremely rubbish and full of drug addicts but the point (laughs) is that it's a sacred place though the parking is terrible but what i want to say the secret of life is love one another yeah love one another and if you listen to my podcast series three it's all about healing yeah it's all about coming together so love one another that's what i said that's oh that's and i didn't actually get paid for a gig come to think of it in macclesfield that's the other thing oh if you do go i'm going to name the pub i think they've left now those people right but they owe me 600 pounds oh wow it's a lot of money it's a lot of money i didn't see them doing a a bunk. No. No one could have foreseen that. No, you see that come in. Oh dear. Well, good morning to Macclesfield. <coughs> yeah, to everybody yeah, there. It's a lovely Macclesfield, really, isn't it? It's it's I've never no, been. No, well. Now, <laughs> Series 3 is out. Now, also, now, this is interesting. Yeah. Dominic Byrne, as you know, yes. is, is he does the celeb video messaging. Oh, yes. Yes. Which, Celeb for which as you know, is a, a waste of time for someone like Dom yeah. sitting next to his 80s hi fi stacking system. Absolutely. And yeah. saying, giving out messages. Yeah. But you, yes. you are also available on celebsvm.com. V- 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 very much so. <laughs> very much <laughs> right. so. Celeb VM. And I will say virtually anything what? for a few quid. <laughs> That's as amazing. As has been proved. That's good wow. to know. I will say happy birthday, celebvm.com. Yeah. And and I will very happily give your birthday messages. I might even wear this outfit. Oh, that's oh, lovely. Because you know, I'm that going back be. on the tube. Right. And um, <laughs> in it. And if I get home, I might do some of this. And if, if somebody wants to, could you also use your abilities? Like if somebody wanted to reach someone yeah. or, you know, they want to ask advice or any questions. I can't or... make this any clearer. Right. I will literally do <laughs> so... anything. <laughs> I will say that's so anything. good of you, though. Yeah, yeah, but that's what I'm like. I'm all giving. Mm, yes, right. you are. Right. Yeah, and is it, for a small is that, fee. Yeah. Is that like 150 pound? No, or it's a, a, it, do you know what? It's very, very reasonable. Re- really, 100 quid. 30, 30, 30 wow. quid. But that's. Yeah. But that's too cheap. Well, like it is almost, isn't it? But that, and I can offer you up, well, you know, the secret of life, manifestation, yeah. any of that sort of stuff. But I mean, for thirty pounds, I mean, that's from a bargain. Celebsvm dot com. That such Clinton Baptiste. That's yeah. please. What does Dom charge for your? N- not as much as you, obviously. Oh, right. No, no. Okay. twenty five for me. Yeah, twenty five. Yeah, yeah. Well, this is right. Mine up. I think you should. <laughs> I think I honestly think you should. I think it cheapens it to discuss the money, really. Well, no, but, it does. but it's it's not. That's just that shows you how in 2020, even through COVID, mm. to be able to reach out to you know big stars so or, or new, someone yeah. like Dominic. Exactly yeah, right. Yeah, Either absolutely. or, and to get something back. But especially the service that you could provide. Yeah. Mm. It's not just saying happy birthday, Julie. But oh. but you said you'll also do that. But it's yeah. reaching out. It's and reaching out using my healing hands. hands. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm a Reiki healer, feeler, and I can do that and reach I out. Know. I mean, yeah. I, look where I live. Mm. I've got to be honest. You know, there's that many electronic ankle tags around there. It does dispel the, <laughs> right. the electronic sure. waves a little bit. It's in a way. In a way. Yeah. 
<laughs> but uh, I can do, I'll try and cure you. It's uh, Actually, that's maybe going too far, but I right. can say happy birthday. But, but to be fair, for that, you could only give it a whirl. Yeah. Give it a whirl? Sure. Blimey, what do you expect? <laughs> Not a miracle worker. Well, I am. Right, well, you are indeed. And once again, it's a pleasure Thank seeing you. you. I always love it when you come in. Oh, I love you. the new outfit. Thank you. Yeah, it's spectacular. It, it is everything, actually. Thank mm. you. Yeah. I thought about putting the collars up, but I think it's not bad, is it? No, it's, it's very not. nice. And, yeah. th- and that helps... Oh, yeah, it attracts, attracts spirits. It attracts the spirits. Spirit does come, does come in. Yeah, yeah, it's lovely. You attract the spirits, don't you, on a Friday, uh, Saturday night? Yes. Oh, yeah, frequently. <laughs> See what I did there, Clinton? Yeah, I did not that. That's very good. I did, cheeky a, monkey. I did a joke about her being, you know... In, a, an alcoholic. Fun- yeah, functioning yeah. alcoholic. Yeah, yeah, that's it. But, uh, but you can't tell at work. Oh, she, well, she spirits it are mm. fading now. Oh, they're oh. going. Fading now. They, they're going now. Okay. And uh, they're saying bye-bye. Bye-bye. See ya. Bye-bye. Ta-da, love. Bye bye, spirits. Bye bye. That's amazing. Queen Mother just leaving now. All right. Oh love. wow, the Queen, Queen Mother. Mother. Yeah, lovely. Oh, on. that is lovely. Well, wow. if you'd like to learn more and to educate yourself with the third series of the Clinton Baptiste Paranormal Podcast, you can get it on the Radio X app. You can yes. get it from where you get your podcast from. You can get it everywhere. Uh, you won't be disappointed. You will. Well, I now. I'm not. I'm only episode one in. Right. And uh, there are only two out at the moment, but that's right. Oh, well, that's okay. That's well, good, though. And uh, Ramon. Yes. Now, he he's made an appearance already. Yes. In episode one. There's yes. a bit of a love-hate relationship there. Very much so. I mean, he is a charlatan. <clears throat> yeah. You know, he couldn't read the flipping yellow pages. No. You know, let alone the, the spirit world. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, Ramon does feature. I know everyone loves Ramon in my podcast. Well, he's, so, he's you know, a very he angry man, I find. He's a very angry man, but we do make up towards the end. Oh, I look no, forward to that yes. episode. And can I just say, talking of that, you know, if you're at home, my advice, my spiritual marital advice, don't go to bed on an argument. No. Right, okay. And you, you suspected of doing something wrong. Always make up before you go to yeah. bed, fellas. Don't matter what you wake up, but make up something for right. crying out loud. <laughs> yeah. God's sake. Definitely. That's yeah. very, very, very good advice. Yeah. And uh, thank you very much. And that's for, for you, in. my love. Got recently married, isn't it? Uh, not yet. Engaged, no. but not Engaged. married. Engaged. Yeah. Lovely, yeah. loving. I'm seeing. Yeah. yeah, I'm seeing. I'd love to do that. At the do afterwards for a small really? fee. I'm seeing me up on that small stage. Wow. Oh, you, oh, at the, at yeah, the I was saying that. I was wow. going to do the other one, wasn't I? Don't matter. That thing's fine. For it. <laughs> don't matter. Don't matter. I'll do it for a pork pie. <laughs> wow. There you are. That, oh, that is lovely. I'll take you up what, on that. Yeah. Bless you. Will she be happily married for, forever? Will, she, will it be a will it very happy marriage? Oh. I've got all the great lovers of the world. Come, Trilis and Cressida, Romeo and Juliet. Lovely. Kylie and Jake, they're still alive. Um, Arthur Mullard and Hilda Baker. Yes. All the greats. All the greats, yeah. Mullard. And they're all oh. saying, they're saying, it's a very, very big future. Oh. A very oh. happy marriage. Lovely. Thank you. There you like, go. Oh, how lovely. 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 Well, I think we should end on that positive note. Yeah, yeah. thank you. Oh. Namaste. Nama- namaste. Namaste, all namaste, all around. Namaste to you. Namaste is all around, guys. The third series is out now. You can download it. I would absolutely advise everyone to listen to the first two episodes today. Treat yourself. Yes. And uh, thank you very much for coming in, Clinton Baptiste. Thank you. Bless you. Thank, thank you, Clinton. Thank you. Thank you. What's he doing, Dominic, now? He's... Bad in now. There you go. Radio X. The Chris Moyle Show. With the green flag.